Hello and welcome back to Kim Plays Into the Breach. We got perfect on the first island and we got the overpowered achievement. Um, the only achievement left for us to get is um, just completing the three islands and getting the three island victory. So, um, you know what? What is this? I like going chronologically for some reason. But I'm just, I'm just tossing between. This one, I like the exploiting Vex. These guys look pretty okay to me though. Uh, that, like, there's no really annoying ones except for the centipede. But this one has the blob, so I definitely don't want to fight that guy. So let's just, yeah, move chronologically. Um, and start off with the test site Delta. And there are some really juicy states over here, look at that. This is, I guess, what we want to achieve. Alright. So, this guy, annoying as usual, we won't be able to kill him, so we should just cancel his attack. Um, this guy is also annoying, but he only, I believe, attacks the first tile in front of us. If we put anything here, we will die. So, let's just move here. Where is this guy going? He could go here though. He could go there. That is scary. Let's see, where is this guy? Oh, this guy is definitely attacking this. Um, should I be here and like open myself to being stringed down? Okay, we should do it like this then. So I can push him down if I need to. This is the scary one. Let's see how we go. Yeah, it's harder to predict what's going to happen. And that was not one of my predictions. This is going to be a tough one to, to solve, actually. I don't even know if we... He's just buried himself in, like, the best itch, like the best spot ever. Oh, we will be able to... Smoke it though. Okay, we're fine. We're fine because we can smoke it. Then we can cancel this guy's attack by jumping over him. And then we can push this guy up one. Oh, phew. This is actually really lucky. I don't know if that sand tile was like... Randomly generated. But that seems to get the job done quite well. Um, we definitely, yep, want to cancel this guy's attack like, ooh, this is amazing. Because we essentially just smoke off this entire Renfield bomb like that, which is really good for us. Oh, and we can cancel his attack like this as well. That's, it's amazing. A right, cloud meta. It's actually happening, guys. So ideally, we want to just smoke off this entire section off. We'll, we'll be a... Vive um, not Vive no, a 5v3, but this looks okay. We can cancel a few attacks, get, get some really good stuff done. Um, there's a lot of things we can be doing as well. And honestly, yeah, this just seems like the biggest cluster. But I think what I want to be doing, I can do that. He's going to die. Should I just do this? Take damage like that? Well, I mean, there's no other way I can... If I kill this guy now, it doesn't really make a difference. Um, all we want to do is attack anyone we can right now. I can come here, push this guy down one, make him attack. Well, you want to be smoking tiles. No, we can't. This guy needs to stay. Um, if I jump over like that, cancel their attacks. This guy needs to be here to block this building.
That means I can stay here and cancel this guy's attack. I'll only take one damage. Yep, that works. And like, just this is when the smokes become like um start to become like an obstacle ourselves. We need to get over, but. Oh, you know what? If I go over here, push him. Who, who's attacking first? This guy's attacking first. Okay, we're gonna. We don't want to take three damage. In that case, yeah, we're canceling his attack like that, and he will die. Um, cool. Do a switch rule like this. I'm gonna jump over both of you guys like this. So you're gonna die. You won't die, but we will block some shots. And <laughs> this is amazing. Really confusing though, but the acid will mean that anyone who tries to land here to attack us will probably die as well. Oh man, this is good. And it might actually end up being us. Never mind. Um, if I come over here, I can push him like that. I can get out of this guy just by doing that. And then he'll he'll die already. Okay. I mean there's no other way I can get out unless I just kill this guy like that. If I do No, I can't. I need to kill this guy. Ooh, yeah. There's a really funny way of doing it. So I hit him back, then I push him one. Um, four, then we'll kill five, and we should be saved. Nice. And then I'm just going to get out of this situation by jumping over. So you should be... Oh, I want to take one damage. Well... Okay. Oh, wait. both of us are going to take one damage because of the smoke. Is that a problem? Not really, but... What's happening? Um, it's the attack order. So, if I did jump out this way, two, you would just hit that. Poison that. Yeah, let's... That will be better for us in the long run. Okay, so we do exactly what we did just then, except with you jumping out of the way like this. And I'm not too fussed about using the reset because we only have one more turn left. Yep, that will work just fine. It means that this guy doesn't die though, but it should be manageable. Excuse me? You're threatening your own friend just so you can... Oh boy. What is going on right now? <laughs> um, it's a lot of crossfire happening. Alright, if you attack me like that, you're going to get hit for one. You're, no, that's really good. Um, I can come here. Block that. That will be good for us. Um, I can kill you like that. I can push you into... Oh, this is fun. This is a fun arm um, situation. Alright. If I go here, that will block the shot. Hmm. All I need to do is get rid of this guy right here. 
If I get rid of this guy... If I get a, get rid of this guy... Um, I can move here. Push this guy. No, he won't die. He won't die that way. Oh no, he will die that way. Wait, who's attacking first? This is important. Two's attacking first, which means he will kill that. So two's attacking. Okay. He's attacking that, so if he hits me, he'll die because I would have pushed him into a wall. That means this is the only other guy I need to worry about. I can just deal with him by standing, by blocking a shot. And I can block a shot. I can block a shot just by staying here. Oh, I can do this. Cancel him like that. Oh man. I shouldn't have left this guy. No. No, no, I should hit. There's not much I can do. Okay. Well, let's, let's think. Or we can just cancel him. Oh. Oh, wait. What the heck? We can just do this and get rid of the, get rid of the threats like that. In that case. Where does that leave us then? If we do that, that's fine. We don't need to worry about it. Um, he's going to attack us like that. So... Nah, then that means... I come over here I can push you wait I can just oh you know what I'm dumb I forgot about this I can jump over there you'll die though then I'll die hey if I jumped over like that I will take a hit from that this guy and this guy Alright, there are a lot of solutions, but there may be only one correct one. Undo. Okay, if I, if I go here, this looks like a really good move for us. First, it blocks this guy, and we can just take this guy out like that. Wait, that... That just solves the problem then. That just solves the problem. We kill this guy. We heal up. And then we just move here. Wait. Okay. Take one da Okay, this guy dies. This guy dies. Um, we will take one damage. Two, three. We'll take three damage. Damn. That's not gonna work. I, I believe it won't work. Um, let's, let's let me check again. So we'll take one, two, and then three like that, and possibly more as well because he will be do one, and then just two like that. Then he's gonna die. Tough. This is a tough one. What was the problem with doing this? We, we get the kills like that, we jump over like that, and then he'll, yeah, he'll die. Not unless we come here and block the shot. But then this will get hit. What if I just pushed this guy? Or if I push this guy, no, that, that would work, right? If I push this guy, then it blocks this. This guy blocks this guy. Oh, 
Oh, wait, okay, this this might work. Push him, get the kill like that. Get these guys. Oh, that works. This works. No, it doesn't. It doesn't, oh man. It doesn't work because of this guy right here. He was still thrown in a building. Wait. I am so close. I am so close to figuring this out. Um... That just looks like... I don't see any better players. If I did this... Kill this guy. Push him. Nah, I reckon I gotta kill these two. Okay. I, I'm pretty done with solving... I'm pretty done with solving this problem, so I'm just gonna... Leave it with the best case scenario I can think of right now. And that's just... Doing something like this. Um, pushing this guy back. Wait, will we die? No, we won't die. Um, yeah, that means this building will be under attack, but it's just one building. And I'm, I'm just going to settle with that, because I honestly... My brain is going to die if I don't do anything right now. So, what's the plan? These guys are going to die. Pushing you... I'm just making sure I don't screw the order up. But I don't think the order matters right now. Wait, I can kill you like that. Wait, let's see. Is there anything else I can do? Ooh. If I did this. Alright, if I healed first, then I did that. This building would still be under attack. I think so, yeah, if I did that. I would die. This guy would die. Yep. Yep, so I'm just gonna push everyone down. Yeah, it just sucks that I'm webbed. If I wasn't webbed, all I could I could just literally move out of the way and this would not be a problem at all. The only reason why this has taken me like 10 hours to do is because I'm webbed. Because if I kill this guy, I can stand here, heal, but he would still be attacking this line right here. It's annoying. Alright, so let's just do it. So we're going to be hit, so I'm going to come around like this. So this building will take one, but that's going to be it. And there we go. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. We've completed our mission. Apologies that took so long, but um, that was a tough situation. Where are you gonna go? Literally anywhere. Um, I'm gonna terraform you guys, so I don't really care. You can maybe attack that. You can. You're gonna come around and attack that. So it's gonna be a little bit annoying to play around. Either way, you're gonna be here. You're gonna be. Oh man, I don't know yet. All right, let's see, let's think. Okay, since you're going to be here, or you could just stay there. How do you, how do you attack you shoot? 
Okay, this is annoying. How are you attacking? You're gonna come here and attack. Okay, this is this is tough. Um, who's dealing with you? Probably you. Okay, if you're dealing with that, you can deal with him just fine. By just smoking. Yeah, you can just put a smoke here. And then, okay, let's play by you. It's never a good idea. But yeah, that sucks. That is okay though. And that is pretty much expected. So I guess we just do what we planned to do. Hit that like that, cancel his attack. And then I can cancel your attack just by jumping, flying over you like so. I'm gonna come here because I can get a bit closer to the center. Wait, where can you move? You can move there so I can stop you from doing that, I believe. Yep. Yeah. I've got five moves, so I am pretty mobile. And that was alright. We got two of the enemies, but it was pretty easy with the terraformer. Yep, so that's fine. We can just push it out of the way. And we can literally do the exact same thing we did to you. And we can just kill you, actually. So I'm going to fly over you like this. Then I'm going to come around here, block a spawn like that. Then I'm going to come maybe here and then just hit you like that. Okay. Yep, that's going to work. You know what? I should have actually terraformed this other side. Because there seems to be a lot of guys in this area. And I highly doubt that they'll be... Alright. So now I'm terraform this top bit. I'll definitely terraform this side bit. Alright, I'm gonna reset tone. Because I think it'll be good for us. So terraform this, I think. Okay, terraform that, do the exact same thing. So, do that. Block the spawn here, and then come around here. Oh, I think we block this spawn that way. We don't need to worry about any threats from this side. Um, yep, yeah, I'll go here. Yep. Hmm, that's okay. We'll continue to stop him. What? Okay. So this is easy. We terraform this, get this, get the kill like that, and then we get the kill like that. And then we'll get also get the kill like that. Alright, but first, first of all we terraform this guy. Everything else is pretty, pretty.
pretty basic. Um, yeah, I'll block a spawn. And I'll do it like this. Genius. Oh, there's just one guy. Alright, we're fine. Um, cancel his attack. Oh, you know what? We can kill him. Um,. And we'll do it just like... You know, it doesn't really matter how we do it. Alright, um, he's gonna take one, alright, never mind, I don't think we can get the kill with this guy, I was like, we can drop a smoke over him, but the smokes don't, like, they don't stack or anything, so we'll just kill him like that, he can get the experience to himself and we'll just terraform this to finish it off, and there we go, it's a perfect mission. I'm pretty good with civilians so far, we've lost like 60, but um, yeah, we're, we're doing the best we can. So that's hopefully going to help us a lot in the future. Um, what do we want to do? Let's defend the earth mover first. This guy is definitely going to come around to these ones, so I'm going to fly over him. This guy, those guys are not a threat at all. I mean, what is this guy going to do? He's going to come to one of these tiles, attacks like that, that's okay. We'll come here to deal with that. We'll put this guy over here to push him in. Please just move forward one. That's okay. He's not... what? Yeah, okay, I can understand. So we'll take out this guy like that. Pretty devastated, we don't get to do the double jump, but that's okay. Um, we can come down here, push this guy over like that, make him attack his own friend. Or we can just cancel his attack altogether. That does, if we cancel his attack altogether it does one damage but it does it doesn't block a spawn though. So we let's go for blocking the spawn. So we push him across one so we got to cancel his attack. And we honestly we just need to go over one because the other cloud, this cloud, putting cloud here doesn't really help us. It helps them more than it helps us. Because it doesn't really threaten anything. So do that, it's going to cancel. Okay. So I'm just going to take this guy out first. Just to make things a lot clearer. Oh, he will die. Sweet. So this is um, 
quite easy, I think. We just move up one, push, push them like that. And we're actually going to move here first, though. Actually, I'm going to move here, push him down one, so he can block a spawn. Then I'm going to move up here, push him down. See you later. Then I'm just going to block a spawn like this. Um, I don't think there's anything I want to fly over. Like, again, with the, like... Flying over and dropping the smoke there isn't going to do anything. So I'm just going to do that. You know, it might. Someone might just spawn here and then attack us, but. He's only doing so because we're there. But they wouldn't be doing that in the first place. What? Okay, I thought it was. Hmm. Sort of he came around like this and just did that. That looks really good. We'll kill both of them. Alright, that's exactly what we'll do then. We'll kill both of them because we can just drop a bomb and then they'll both die to the smoke. So, we'll do this. You're there, okay. We're just figuring out what are the best spawns to be blocking. Uh, maybe this one. Yep, so they'll both be on two, and then that will... Yep, this works really well. And then we'll just fly over both of you, and you'll both be dead. Yeah, nice. Should just be a 2v1. Alright. <clears throat> it's um, interesting for well, this guy's final move, he like decides to fight us rather than his own friend, but this is easy. Um, we just fly over him one, then fly over back. So we'll just do this. And we finally get to pull off our, our big plays. Nice. So he'll die. That's all the enemies read of as well. So that was a good mission. Saved all the civilians as well this time. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're going for the, going for the two stars. We've got to go for it. Where is this guy going? Probably here, or anywhere. Um, this guy is the biggest threat. This guy is also a threat. He might come there. Uh, if we put ourselves, if we do this, what does it look like? Um, Where is this guy going? He could go there. Um, so I'm gonna swap. I'm gonna put him back. We'll start from the back lines. We'll see if we can move towards the front later on towards the game, towards the mission. But this this looks all right. Yep. <clears throat> So we've got the back um, back half covered, and we've also got the front half covered. Sometimes when the enemies have like a million like different places that they can move, it makes it a lot harder just to just to see what's happening. Um, but we can just cancel both of these guys' attacks in one turn. We can remove this guy, and then we can just push this guy onto a spawn. So let's do that.
It might have been worth it actually putting the smoke cloud back one. But I'm not resetting a turn just to do that. That just seems inefficient. And then we're just sending two smoke tiles like that. Oh, you're sweet. You're going to die. That's okay. That's a good turn. So you kill two guy, you kill a guy and you block a spawn. It's great. Well, this guy is obviously getting pushed into the water. Unless he moves there, he's still gonna die though. If we can fly over this, cancel some, we'll cancel the attacks. And then, yeah, that seems like a... Seems great for us, actually. Let's do that. And then we can... That will allow us to push you back one to block a spawn again. Before I do that, though, I'm gonna just shoot you like this. And then I'll, yep, yeah, get you to... Kindly just block a spawn for us. Um, 4v3, that's okay. This will be the only spot that this guy spawns. Okay, that will throw in the train, but unless he flies. If he flies, then he can go all the way there. That's okay. This looks easy. We collect this, you can get pushed into the water. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Never mind. Um, I do want to get the kill on this guy. I might do that by just like pushing him into the wall like that. That will definitely secure the kill. Um, if I go here, I can get the kill like that on that guy. And then if I come here, or if I jump over him, then I can get... And I'm going to do something crazy. I'm going to... Actually... You know what? I don't even get the kill if I do that. Hmm. I can only get the kill on one of these guys. So... If I push him in, that will definitely get the kill. Oh, no. Oh, dude. Two, three... One, two, three, four. If I could move five, I would go here just to jump over and get the kill like that. Unfortunately, I took that point out of the double. Um, does that even make sense? <laughs> Alright, um, if I move here, that's not going to do anything. Yep, the only kill I can get on this guy is by doing this. I'm going to get the kill... Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna get the kill on this guy just because it's way more efficient to get like kill a guy with five health than just one. It feels better. Um See if I fly over like this, I can't fly back. So that seems really dumb. If I started here though, I would be able to do it, but I'm not. So these mountains, man. And then, yep, I'll just kill you like this. Cool. Oh my goodness, I didn't even know he did 3 damage. That could have gone really bad. If I had, like, one less health. There we go, though. Another 1,000 civilians protected. We got the science class weapon, which I might as well equip right now. Oh, oh man. Alright. Oh, that's interesting. That's really interesting. Um, 
This is what we'll do. So we have um, let go of the double shot dream just because I don't think it's been working out for us. Um, I don't know about this. I mean, it looks like it will help us, so I'm gonna put it there. Yeah, this doesn't look really good because we already we already do have like smoke bomb moves. I'm gonna put it into move. This one. And we've got a spare one. For a smear mech reactor, I'm gonna put it into the shield self. We'll see how we go. I highly doubt that it's the right play. How does how do you attack? You attack by doing three like that. So you can literally come onto these two tiles like this, or you can come up to this one to troll me. If you do that, I literally have no way of stopping you. There is literally no way of stopping you if you do that, so please don't do that. Um, how are you attacking? You're gonna, you have also a lot of options. I want to kill you, so where are you gonna move? You're gonna move somewhere across these three, across these four. So I'm gonna try to match you on that by putting me here. And honestly, it's not much. Not many places for you to go. Ooh, you can apply acid actually, so you're you're really helpful. I'm gonna put you here. Wait, does it make a difference? No, it does not make a difference. Ooh, if you come around here, we'll be able to push you. No, but I can come across five if I go here. Oh no, but I won't be able to because if you come here. Alright, this looks like the best setup for us. So that's fine. That is also fine. And that is actually great. And that's great for us because if you... We can literally push you across and you will apply poison to both these everyone right here so I'm gonna shoot you across like this and I want you to apply poison to this guy so I'm not gonna I'm going to attack you. After you kill this guy, you will still be on 1 HP. That's fine. <clears throat> Complicated turn, but we did take use a lot of um, enemies to our advantage. This guy will die. This guy will also die. This guy is annoying. We will push him back one to make him block a spawn. This guy though is however just dead. To fly over like him, he's gonna die. And I wanna push him back one. You know what? Discard this. I would honestly much rather keep this acid projector than the repulse. Oh repulse shields him though. Oh, that's interesting. The question then becomes, do I want the shield or do I want... That is really interesting. I'll need to think about that. Because... Oh, wow. Oh, we don't even block the small because you'll die. Okay, that's fine. It was like a two for one. Um, this guy will get acided and so will this guy. He's not doing anything, so we're pushing him into the water. Before we do that though, I'm just going to fly over these guys. 
you're getting pushed into the water. Like this. Oh. No, if we, we can't... See, we can't even repulse because it'll push this guy out of the way. Oh man. Dude, this acid projector. Is that what it's called? Acid, yes. It looks so much better than what we have going on right now. Any other ways to deal with this? Not really. Okay. You're dead. And again, get acided. Wait, is it because they die with the acid that... Does it create more acid? I have no idea what's going on. Um... Yeah, this is how you'll die. Kind of like a million ways to solve this. Um, I'm going to shoot you with acid though. So you're going to take... 2 damage. Um, do you get both the XP or does he get 1 XP? Because, okay, that's how it works. Yeah, so he died, so he left a pool of acid, so I believe this guy should leave a pool of acid here when he dies. Dude. That's actually amazing. I don't even know if we want to spend points in repulse. Repulse. I still can't say that properly. Here we go, the mission completed. I think we perfect that, that as well. Oh my goodness. Oh. oh, what is this prime class? Okay, can't get that. Hit Chen wrong. After attacking, gain plus one free tile movement. Oh, wait. Got one. Oh, that's... We can't even upgrade that. Reputation reward. Let's go for Chen Rong, I think. I mean, we can sell... This only sells for one reputation. This sells for two. Um, so if, if, if we want to sell him, we can. Let's see what you get. Dude, 10 corporate reputation. What? That's amazing. The audience hand a shield after taking damage. No, thank you. Pull target towards you one tile. No, thank you. Prime class weapon. Can't do anything for that. Airstrike. Don't really need that. Okay. So we can just buy three of these. That seems like a sensible move. Um... I'm gonna do this right. Plus two mech HP. Plus one mech move. Do we even we don't even need repulse. But me we might as well. Spend reputation. Alright. We don't need We don't need the auto shields because I don't want to take building damage. We're preventing that that more than letting them attack it and then activating the shield. These smoke bombs didn't really seem to help us. That's mainly because I think... So the idea is, do we want to take Rep Repulse away and then put the smoke bombs there? I'll tell you what. Take one away, install that. Shield friendly, instead of shield self. Because shielding self, we might as well push them away. We only need to shield ourselves if like three guys are like, like... Look at this picture to our right, like when are we ever gonna find ourselves in that situation? Am I right? If we do... Then... I mean, that that's on us, man. It's, that's not on, it's not on them. Okay, we've got two more. React calls we can spend. We can increase our damage, that looks really good. Do we need more health? Um, kinda, kinda. I wouldn't mind. Oh, this though, this. Can't believe we we forgot about that. Well, that's definitely going there. We have one more corporate reputation to spend. Oh, we've got one here. Um. That looks good. Spend reputation. So we are using all of this, which looks like a lot of, lot of stuff that we've got going on. But
Do we want the smoke bombs? That's the question. The answer is no, I think. Okay. So I don't even know if we need the smoke bombs because what's the point? Oh, I guess we can. Because we can sell the smoke bombs and the this guy right here for one more core reactor. And oh, yeah, just this acid projector feels like it would do way more damage than the smoke bombs, even though the smoke bombs. This is the tough. This is a tough decision. I'm gonna decide on this off camera since I have no idea how long this is gonna take. So I'm just gonna leave it there for this episode. So thanks a lot for watching. Uh, have a great day, and I'll see you next time.